Welcome back to TechPress. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to create product bundles into your Shopify store. A really easy process and of course, totally for beginners. The very first thing you want to do is to access your Shopify store. If you don't have Shopify store, you have to worry about that. I'm going to leave the link down below in the description so we can all get started totally for free. So now that you have access directly into your Shopify store, we want to log in into the administration bar section. So what I need to do, of course, is to get started and install a product bundling application. So what I'm going to be doing here is to open a new tab. I'm going to go into apps.shopify.com. With your Shopify uh, logged in, you can locate that there's a lot of applications that you can use to use to download it and install it directly into your store. If I go into the upper side, you can see that we can type the word Shopify. Here, if I type the word Shopify, it's going to be showing me a lot of applications that were created for the actual Shopify store. So here, what I need to do is to look out for the Shopify bundles. There is a bunch of applications that you can configure, of course, and download. But in this case, for this tutorial, I'm going to be using a application that was created for Shopify. So I'm going to install this. Of course, you want to make sure that the price is totally for free. So please take that in mind. So once you hit into install, it's going to be asking us to install the application. So I need to hit now into install. So as you can see now, we are now inside the actual Shopify building bundles. So this is the second part, configuring the application. So once the application is now being installed, you want to operate from the left policies applications. We can see that we have it bundles. So I need just to enable this that says pinned to the navigation bar. So here, what I need to do is to create a new bundle. So as you can see, we have the create bundle. And it's going to be asking you to select the products which you'd like to add into a bundle. Now, in this part, it's going to be really important to have products that you can use to use for this bundle. So for this tutorial, what I'm going to be using is to first go back, go into my products and make sure that I have three different product elements in order to create one bundle. Now that I have my products, I can, of course, create a bundle. So let's go back directly into the Shopify bundles. I'm going to reload this page directly into my bundles. As you can see that, of course, it's been updated my products. So I can create one bundle and hit into title. In this case, I'm going to name this royalty bundle and select the products. In this case, I'm going to go for the cap, the loyalty pack, the royalty cap mark, and the sticker. The four of them into just one bundle. I select all of them. And now, as you can see, we have now the components. This can include three, 13 different products, limits for bundle options and variants of the same other products. So as you can see, we have five out of three options. In this case, we're only able to add three options. So what I need to do is to make sure that I delete this uh, bundle element. And of course, I have a hundred variants, but in this case, I have 640 variants, which in this case, this one won't be uh, available for all of it. So in this case, I have my loyalty cat stickers. I'm going to just select the three of them. I have the loyalty cat mark and the color loyalty back, which is in this case, here's the other two colors and the back size. So what I need to do is just to select or unselect the elements that I do or do not want to see. For example, here, I can delete the mark or the sticker. So I can select it and go for remove the product. And there we go. So make sure that everything is not, of course, into red and go for saved and continue. Once you have just named the title and added the products, the bundle should be created now into your store. So let's make sure that the bundle has now been correctly uh, set it up. And now we can set it up a bundle pricing. So we can just start by selecting the products to set the pricing for the product bundle. And we can offer a discount on the total price of the item when purchase them together. So as you can see, here are the variants, the Cold Cats loyalty back color. Here is the new color and here are all the variants added. So as you can see, here is the custom price. I can apply this to all the variants, so I can just leave this as it is. Usually here into the category, we can use this as suggested and upload a selecting existing medium. So what I'm going to be doing here is to choose the marked elements that, of course, are directly into my products. I'm going to go for product number one. This should be my product number two. I'm going to hit now into save. And of course, make sure that I hit into view so I can preview my bundle. 
So as you can see, this is the Loyalty Cool Cats bundle. Here is the actual price and it comes with four of them. So what I can tell suggest you is that would you create a bundle, create an image that appeals the actual three colors, three products to add it in just one element. So make sure all of those have now added into your bundle images. Hit now into save and you're actually good to go. And save and publish your actual bundle. Lastly, what you can do is to promote your new product bundle through various marketing channels. You can create a dedicated section on your homepage to send an email campaign through your social media to highlight the bundle offer. So guys, with that being said, you can now reach to the very end of the video. But don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools how you can get started with your actual new bundling and much more great applications and apps at Shopify. Thank you so much for watching the video guys. Hopefully with all that being said, you can see you to a brand new section of TechPress. See you next time.